Hey, it's Kyle from Clean Technica coming to you today from the Solo Wheel V10F. This little guy down here um, is actually the big boy of the family. It's the uh, the largest Solo Wheel uh, in the in motion lineup. Uh, this thing, compared to the other two, is crazy. Um, it's got the biggest motor, the longest range. It'll go, and this sounds crazy for a unicycle, an electric unicycle, but this thing will go 60 miles, six zero miles per charge, uh, plus or minus, depending on the terrain and the uh, the weight of the, the rider and how you ride it and all of that, just like in an electric car, just like on an electric scooter, any of those other things. Um, but it's got a huge 16 inch rim, um, which is the same as the Glide 3 that we've previously reviewed, um, but it has a big two and a half inch wide tire on it and, and that extra rubber makes a big difference uh, both in ride quality it's got extra air volume in it so it's much more comfortable to ride it absorbs any of those bumps or uh, curbs or mountains you end up going over or around or down um, but also in terms of the feel uh, so when you're, you're going around curbs you've got a lot more surface area to work with and that impacts the feel of the ride um, initially on the first time I took this thing out uh, this is like my third time riding it here um, at the Alt Car Expo in Santa Monica. Um, but the first time I took it out, I was just having a hard time getting a feel for this thing. And uh, now on my third time on this thing, it just feels great. It feels like I'm floating on a cloud. Uh, that extra air volume has a major impact. Um, in, the, in the Glide 3, uh, which is the V8, uh, you can feel a lot more of the bumps. In this thing, it just feels like you're in, almost in a car where you've got that kind of absorption in the in the tire, uh, a lot more bounce in it, uh, and it just feels great. Um, in addition to that, the tire has a little more tread to it, so the uh, the Glide 3 um, is a rather smooth tire. It's got a little bit of tread to it, uh, but this thing's actually got some meat and some, uh, some serious traction on it, so for anybody taking it off-road or just on some rugged terrain around town or in in bad weather, it gives you kind of extra stability um, that you might be looking for. So uh, again, this is the in motion, um, the Solo Wheel V10F, um, 40 to 60 mile range, depending on how you ride it. You can see the uh, the Meteor tire there down at the bottom. Um, on the front here, you can see it's also got the same headlight um, that, that was featured on, on the Glide 3. Uh, it also has a speaker there. Uh, the Glide 3 has a speaker as well that it uses to yell at you. Um, if you go too fast, if uh, it's running out of batteries, things like that. This one will actually play music uh, out of that. So it's got a Bluetooth connection, just like the Glide 3, but it uses that to stream music through this speaker, which is kind of great. Um, what you'll notice here, if you're used to solo wheels, you're familiar with them, is these pedals are larger. And what that means is that for people that are larger like me, uh, that's more surface area to absorb my weight. It's more stability for my feet. It also provides a lot more comfort for my feet. So in the Glide 3, if you're riding extended distances, so I've taken it on some six to 10 mile rides and your feet do get a little bit fatigued. Um, in this one, these larger pedals will make a bigger difference uh, with that and give you a little bit more time on the wheel without getting fatigued. Um, you'll also notice this little gripper on the top. This is the same handle that was offered as an option on the Glide 2, so the little guy. Um, and it's just a way for you to carry it. So if you're, uh, you're kind of cruising around town on transit, uh, you pull the pedals up, obviously, and then you can walk this thing around like a, a dog or like an electric unicycle, obviously. Uh, but it's kind of nice um, for those times when you're done riding, beginning of the ride, the end of the ride, things like that. Uh, so again, this is the InMotion Solo Wheel V10F. Uh, it's the highest end version of the Solo Wheel that they offer. Um, and just an all-around beast. Uh, the one thing I didn't mention is it's got a higher top speed. The uh, Glide 3, the uh, V8, as it's also known, has a top speed of around 20 miles an hour. This thing will go up to 25 miles an hour. Uh, that's where you really start to, to need the uh, extra uh, cushion of the tires, the extra stability of the tires, um, and it's, uh, it's a great machine. Uh, I would call this one of the ultimate personal electric vehicles on the market today and uh, something I'm excited to be trying out and uh, really looking forward to, uh, to telling you guys about. So uh, again, this is Kyle Field from Clean Technica coming to you live from the Alt Car Expo in Santa Monica 2018.